Hello and welcome to another show, Temples of Golden Light. I'm your radio host, Linda Jarrett, and I live in England, UK. The reason this show is called The Temples of Golden Light is because I've channeled 144 temples that connect and act as the grid work all around the planet. I'm also clairvoyant and psychic, and I'm a meditation teacher. Um, I am an author, yes, I've written a book, Temples of Golden Light, and I'm a writer for two magazines, one in the USA and one over here in the UK. I run spiritual workshops and meditation groups, and I have my own healing practice Monday to Friday every week. And I've been a healer for many, many years now. I first channeled the temples six years ago, and it took quite a while to get to the point where I've actually now written a book. The Temples of Golden Light are here for humanity. They have been given as a gift from Source to heal humanity, to help humanity, to heal and also to help Mother Earth to heal. The temples connect to Source. So when you visit the temples either during meditation or contemplation or your sleep time, because you can connect to a temple if you set the intention just before you go to sleep, then when you connect with that temple, then you will connect to light from source. So after you've connected with the temple, when you walk upon the earth, you also then anchor that light into the earth, and that way you are helping Mother Earth. So the temples help heal people, adults, children, animals, as well as the earth. And they also help guide you, give you clarity, abundance, help you believe in yourself and manifest whatever you wish for. So I'm going to now connect you just very briefly to the seventh most powerful temple of golden light, which is in the etheric over Machu Picchu, Peru. So if you take a moment to sit down in your own sacred space and just take in three deep breaths. So as you breathe in love and breathe out gold, I'd like you to imagine breathing out old energy and breathing in new energy. So breathe in love and breathe out gold. And one more time, breathing in love and breathing out gold. Now, all of the temples of golden light are surrounded by special high vibration angels, and they are called the rainbow angels. And the rainbow angels are overlit by two new archangels to our planet, and they are called Archangel Metazeal and his twin flame, Archangel Honoriel. And around each temple of golden light, there are a group of rainbow angels. So the rainbow angels surround you now. I will take you on a journey to the seventh largest powerful temple of gold light in the etheric over Machu Picchu, Peru. And this temple of golden light is surrounded by a city of light, as 33 of the temples of gold light are surrounded by cities of light. And in the cities of light, there are schools of learning, mystery schools of teaching, and healing centers, and much more. So you arrive now at the Temple of Golden Light in the Etheric over Machu Picchu, and you'll find yourself now inside the temple. And it is a huge, very powerful Temple of Golden Light. And this temple is all about enlightenment. So as you connect to this temple, you will find that your crown chakra is cleared and cleansed of any negativity. Any negative thoughts will now start to be cleared. It also activates your higher chakras, as there are chakras also above your crown chakra, which is just above your head. So all of your chakras will be cleared. And by helping your crown chakra to be cleared, this helps you receive pure thoughts. And this helps you to connect to the universe and also connect more deeply to Mother Earth. And this temple also connects out into 
our wonderful universe and connects to all the star systems and the other planets within our universe. So this clearing of your crown chakra will help you create, manifest, help you with abundance, help you to unblock and release old energy, help you to be balanced, help you to be in harmony, help you to feel joy and help you to feel love. And also, of course, to enlighten you and to give you clarity. So as the rainbow angels surround you now, they also are helping you to clear all of your other energy centers and chakras and to also clear your auric field, which can sometimes get cluttered with negative energy, but also sometimes you can get dumped on by other people's negative energy. So your auric field is now being cleared and cleansed. So you'll begin to feel lighter and brighter. And you may receive a gift from the Temples of Golden Light. As the Temples of Golden Light will clear your cellular memory and help you to feel upliftment and inspiration. So now I'd like you to feel yourself coming back into your sacred space. And once again, take three, breath, three deep breaths to firmly anchor you to Mother Earth and visualize long, thick, golden roots flowing from the soles of your feet all the way down through all the levels of the rock and soil and place your golden roots into an area of water deep within the planetary core. So you are now fully grounded and anchored to Mother Earth. And if you'd like to read any more about my work, just go on my website www.templeofgoldenlight.co.uk and www.templeofgoldenlight.com and also Facebook, Linda Jarrett, Temple of Golden Light and also another Facebook called Temple of Golden Light and Twitter, Linda Jarrett, Temple of Golden Light. So, now you're beautifully cleared and cleansed. So I'd now like to take my first caller. Hello. Hi. I'd also like to thank A1R Psychic Radio Network, the number one psychic radio around the world, and on planet Earth, and also Moonstruck TV and I'm very grateful for them to be able to facilitate this show. So just a little bit more about the Temps of Golden Light and also I have developed affirmation creams. Now affirmation creams are all about helping you to feel abundant, to help you feel tranquility, to help you feel inner peace, to help you be balanced, to help you see with clarity and also they will help you to feel heart-centered and to feel empowered. Also they can help you manifest and create whatever you wish in life. They can help you to have magical days. They can help you to feel joy and self-confident. So now I am ready to take a caller, Rebecca in Louisville, Kentucky. Hello. 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 Uh, I'm Hi, Rebecca. I'm Linda from England, UK. How can I help you? I was interested in the medium dip. Okay, yeah. Who is it you'd like to connect with? We we only have a few minutes, so um, if you can just name the person. 
Her name is Mary Copley. Her name is Mary Copley. Okay. Yes, I can I can see a lady now. Yes, yeah, she's she's coming closer. She feels she feels very motherly, very um what we call in England very mumsy. Um w would you like to ask her a question? Um is my current situation going to end okay? She's saying definitely yes. I've got a very loud yes there. She does seem to know all about your situation. She hasn't told me your situation, but she she knows about it. And she said definitely yes. She's saying to be patient. Um, she's feeling that you could be a little bit more patient with with somebody around you. Is that right? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it's difficult, isn't it? Um, she's saying just be a little bit more patient and a little bit tolerant and um, it will be okay. She thinks it will be okay. She doesn't know. She, she doesn't. She thinks it will be okay. Um, I get the feeling here more for the for the time being. It it will all it will all be okay and blow over. I mean, long term, as it, it, you know, in the distant future, she's not so sure that there may be a couple of changes. But at the moment, she thinks that everything will and can be okay. Awesome. Mary's, you know where I love her. Oh, she she knows she knows she knows she knows yeah she she is she is with you quite a lot actually she um she's a motherly motherly figure she's she's lovely soul beautiful soul very gentle um and, yeah. and she's very gentle and angelic soul i would say her energy is very gentle she's very thoughtful very kind very caring very loving you know and to be honest she's with you a lot in fact i can do you, with me all the time yeah, she. I was just about to say she's she's with you daily. I feel, I feel as if you talk to her a lot. I feel as if she she. Um, do, do you pray, okay, lady? Praying. Do you do you pray? Yes, I've been praying a lot here lately. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because that's what she's saying. That you 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 talk to her and it's like a prayer. You know, you like you you pray. And what she does for you is she. Because she's in the spirit world, she prays for you on the other side. So that's how it works sometimes. So you're asking her for help, and she's praying for you on the other side. But she says that everything will be okay. Um, you know, just be a bit patient, a bit tolerant. She knows that you're getting frustrated. She knows that you, you, you've really, in many ways, you've had enough. But what she's saying is it is worth just holding on at this moment of in time okay awesome thank you so very much all right i hope i've been helpful yes you have you really is have any, thank you. is there is there anything else you want to ask before you go just ask her to stay with me oh yeah yeah she's with you she's with you she's with you all the time don't worry about that. She's not going anywhere. She's with you. All right? All right. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye, Rebecca. Okay. Um, Mary. Hello, Mary in Ocala, Florida. Hello, Mary. Hi, Mary. Oh, hi, Mary, from, uh, you're in, oh, oh, uh, hi, hello again. Okay, I'm just going to talk again about the Tempest of Golden Light, being given a lovely opportunity to talk about more about the Tempest of Golden Light. 
today. Um, the Temples of Golden Light are goddess Temples of Golden Light, so they do connect to Mother Mary, Kuan Yin, Mary Magdalene, Pallas Athena, to um, the Indian goddesses of the goddess Kali, Durga, Shakti, um, Lashmi, she's the Indian goddess of abundance. They also connect to the Grecian goddesses, Pallas Athena, Aphrodite, Artemis, and many, many goddesses around the world. And of course, they are overlit by three goddesses themselves, Lady Nada, who's a twin flame of Jesus Christ, and also Goddess Jacinta, who when she last lived here, she was a Mayan elder, so she connected to the rainforest and also to nature and Mother Earth's heart center. And when I feel Goddess Jacinta, she really feels Mother Earth and her heartache and how much um, suffering, you know, that, that humanity has put Mother Earth through. And also there is Goddess Lathinda. Now, Goddess Lathinda overlights the Temps of Golden Light because she comes from another universe. It is the universe of golden light. Now, on the planet at the moment, of course, everyone is going through what is called ascension. And ascension is a process. It is a way of raising our vibration because Mother Earth is raising her vibration. So we need to raise our vibration as well. And Mother Earth now, the reason she's raising her vibration is because she is in line with all of the other planets and star systems within our universe. And then our universe will connect to other multi-universes and galaxies. So we have to be ready. People are coming to the end of karma. I do a lot of readings these days, clairvoyant readings, psychic readings, where people have actually they haven't got any more karma. You know, people have come here. They've done their karma. Karma is all about cause and effect. And people have done their karma, so they have no karma to do, so they're karma free. So it's all about creating and manifesting what you want at this time. So I'm going to take another caller, Tammy in Bay City, Michigan. Hello, Tammy. Hi there. Hello. How are you? How are you? I'm all right, thank you. I'm very well. How are you? What would you like me to do? Do you like mediumship? Would you want to read? How can I help you? Well, my life has stopped, basically stopped in its tracks because I've been caretaking for two individuals who are very, very close to the other side. They're getting closer each day. Um, yes, yes. I, I'm, I'm wondering... Yeah. Is my is my life going to start up again anytime soon? It, I feel stagnant. Uh, I'm not moving. I yeah. I, I, yeah. I, I don't know how to explain it. Yeah, I understand. Yeah, I do. I feel I I can feel your your pain, your heartache. Yeah, I I really I can feel heartache. Bless you. You're going through a lot of stuff at the moment, and I do realise and understand that each day is difficult and it's got harder and harder for you. How old are you now, my darling? I'm 48. Oh, bless you. Yeah, you, you've got a lot of happiness to come. You really have got a lot of happiness. I do feel that the two people that you're looking after, they're not very much longer here on the planet, my darling. Um, That's what I feel. It would be a blessing. I know that sounds strange, yeah, but it would be a yeah. blessing. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. I think we're just talking... Um, it's difficult to say when people are going to depart the planet. You know, everybody's soul has their own choice of when they leave. Right. And every, every, each person has what we call five exit points. Um, but the, these two people are going very soon. One, I feel, may go oh, with a few weeks. I mean, you know. That would very, be such a blessing. Yeah. There's, I, there's, I, I pray. I pray. Yeah. 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 I, I, I pray for you too, my darling. I, I, we'll, we'll pray now that. Um, what are their names? Eric, Eric and Perry. Yeah. Sorry. Eric, Eric is the one that's. Eric is the one that's very, very. And, and a lot, it is a divorce, and Terry is 
right behind him. Yeah, okay. We'll, we'll pray for Eric and Terry that they can pass over soon. I feel with Eric it might even be days, my darling. I, I'm, you know, he's, he's near the end, sweetheart. He's, um, bless him. He's, he's had enough. And, and so wow. has Terry. Terry's had enough as well. They just, they just want to go. And I do see a huge, huge amount of light for both of them. There's, there's this huge, huge amount of light. And what, what, what we're going to do is we're going to ask for the angels to create a corridor of light. So when they pass over, and it's not that long away, both of them actually, when they pass over, they move gently and slowly through a corridor of angels. And, when they, get to, and when they get to the end of the corridor of angels, there will be their family members, friends, and acquaintances, everyone that they knew, you know, from their life here, okay? So we've asked for that for Eric and Terry. So what I'm showing now is lots and lots of angels are waiting for both of them when they do pass over, okay? okay. And they'll both be welcomed into the angelic realm into lots and lots of huge, huge amount of light, okay? Now, when this happens your life is going to actually start over again. So, um, have you got family? Are the members of the family? I have um, one yeah. son and, and my mother. Yeah, I do and my feel son that... is, My son is disabled, but he's healthy disabled. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get. Yeah, yeah. He's he's okay. He's okay. He 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 understands so much more um, oh, than yeah. people. But the, you know, he he's he's um he's telepathic, and he understands so much more than um some people think he does or give it him credit for. He, he's exactly. Very, he's, he's he's very he's very clever. He's very clever, actually. He's he's yeah, far more clever. He you know he understands everything, and he knows exactly what is going on. And you don't have to tell him what's going on because he just knows it. Um, exactly. Yeah, you, you know, I do feel that there is there is a lot of support. For for you um, from your family and also mm -hmm. from your also from your close friends around you exactly. I, th I, I think you have um, a nice group of, of really close friends I, I don't think there's loads and loads of, I, I think you're very choosy you know um, it's mm. very import, important very important to you that your friends are really loving and kind and understanding and you, and you have a lovely close group of friends and I feel that they're all going to support you and life will get better and I do see you receiving um, there's some more money there's some more cash coming don't don't worry so much about money because what I'm getting from your your angels and your um, earth guides and helpers in the spirit world, th there is some money coming for you, okay? Oh. I don't know where it's coming from, but I get, be prepared, because money is definitely coming. Oh, you oh. helped me. You've given All me right. peace. I pray okay. on these things, and everything yeah. you've told me validates my, what I've been feeling intuitively. Oh, oh bless, bless you. you! Thank you yeah. so much. It, it is such a difficult time for you. It, it it's been a real. I'm told it's been a real challenge. It's been a real, real tough, tough journey. But um, you will get through it. And w what I'm getting, w when you've been through this, you're actually going to be a lot stronger within yourself. This whole journey experience is going to help you to be, you know, you're going to you're going to, you're going to gain um, an inner peace, but also an inner strength. Does that make Good. sense? Yeah, does yeah. that make sense? Yeah, it's an inner peace, inner strength, and an inner knowledge because this will also help you to understand. Um, what other people go through, you know, and, and it's difficult. But you'll be fine. You'll be absolutely fine. And once this is over, you, you have a lot of happiness to come. Oh, thank and, you. And your son thank is you. lovely. He's gorgeous, your son. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Yeah. That's okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, thank you. All right. Thank you. Lovely to help you. Love so, and light to you. 
Okay, lovely. Thank you. All the best for the future and take care. Okay, so another lovely show. Um, we've had two lovely callers, Rebecca and Tammy. Now, um, if anyone wants to know anything about my work, then please do just visit my website. The main one is Templar Golden Light at, um, oh, I forgot my own website now, templargoldenlight.co.uk. And that will explain all about the Temple of the Golden Light. There are 144, um, and they're in the etheric, not the physical, they're in the etheric of Mother Earth and the place all around the world. Next week, we're going to be connecting to another Temple of Golden Light, and that is Stonehenge. Stonehenge in my own country of England, UK, that is very well known to be a multi-dimensional vortex of energy and wonderful light. So I'm working my way through the 12 main temples of golden light. And then we're going to connect to another six smaller but just as powerful temples of golden light. And that I will do um, after the next ooh, five temples of golden light. So we'll have then done 12 temples of golden light. So that's goodbye from me, Lynn Jarrett, England, UK. And I hope you look, hope you've loved my show and I look forward to speaking to you all again next week.